What is up, YouTube? It is your boy, Jad, here from Pupil Plot Play and some more Satisfactory. Let's get to Howdy. it. Howdy, Sarge. Howdy. I like your comment, by the way. That was good. <laughs> I figured you'd like that. Uh, it's, that's good. It's, it's good, yeah. Yeah. That's a lot of goats. 205 goats. Seems like a lot of goats. Somebody, a lot of people have been busy. All right, so first things first, y'all. I have I have a hard drive in here. Uh, Sarge, what do you think? Alt recipe for computers, alt recipe for uh, reinforced plate, or for uh, rotors? What do we think? If we do the plate one, it gets rid of screws for plates, but we also have a really, really, really overpowered screw factory. Don't take that out of context. Um, so, I don't know. Yulberry, thanks for the gift sub. Chuck Appreciate it. 99 cheered Dex 100. Holly Goaty, that's a lot of goats. <laughs> I will see myself out. God. Yulberry, why? Yulberry, if that person shows up, I'm holding you personally responsible. Just so you know, Yulberry. Uh, thanks to the gifts up in the midst, though. Appreciate y'all. Uh, John, hello. How's it going? What do you think, Sarge, on our alt recipes here? Um, what do we have uh, over abundance of? Uh, we have a ton of... The, the factory that Goaty made for screws is, like, way overpowered. So. Doritos, Cool Ranch, Papa Dia, Papa John's. What? <laughs> what? So That's what? kind of a hard call as far as which... I know. Oh, man. I think the computers are the best option of these three. I think computers, too. Okay. I'm going to yeah, check cool. up. Because the plates, like I said, we have a, a stupid abundance of screws, so, like, that's not a problem. And we already have a uh, alt recipe for screws that uses even more screws. Or not screws, for plate. We'll just go computers and be done with it. Or, yeah, computers. All right, so chat. And Sarge, I don't... Where are you on the map? Uh, Over at my factory. Okay, so you haven't probably seen this either, but chat, get ready for this. Leonard made a little something here uh, the other day, guys. Okay. How do you remove the offset? It's the... Oh, let's see. It's the button in the top right, uh, saying camp of the offset section, like an arrow. Yeah, it says something like revert or something like that. Yeah. Something like that. All right, so Leonard, uh, we have, well, by the way, we have a trophy now, Sarge. I don't know if you've seen this guy yet. Out of the awesome uh, shop, because we have nice. um, a lot of tickets. So Leonard put in a parking spot here at the house, or at the main thing, for trains. So we can park uh, six trains now. <laughs> and a couple of these here, the, the red and white one's my, like, I call it my work train. And then Leonard has his green work train. And then I actually brought another train over here today just because I thought it'd be fun to like take it off and let it go back in service. So that's my iron ore train from uh, the other side of the map. So we'll let him go, but we're going to follow him as well. So, yeah. And now I will say driving trains is a little leggy or just like going from part A to part B on the map, a little leggy. Uh, once we get to a part of the map though, and we're like in that area, it's not bad. We're doing a lot of stuff on this map now, so. Yeah. And then underneath that, there's a bunch of garages for, like, cars, too, if we wanted them. So, it's a whole thing. What's up, Plugger? How's it going? And all of this is over where we started, right? Yeah, this is back at the mainland. So, if you need to, yeah. basically, if you need a bunch of supplies, spawn yourself a train, drive over here, and just grab it and throw it in your train. This is what we've been doing. It's pretty awesome. Uh, Leonard has aluminum set up, but I don't think he has an output yet, so we're not going to mess with that. Hopefully he'll be here tonight, but you never know. Never know. 
It does look nice, right, Panther? It does. Hunter did a good job. We, uh, we also have a quartz factory set up as well. That's off to the right here. If we were to go that away, that's our quartz factory. Up there, we're making all of our wire from uh, Caterium. And that is all uh, functional as well. And actually, I think that factory's full. Like, all the outputs are full right now because we were hauling a bunch of uh, Caterium up there the other day. So that is full, full. Uh, right now. So instead of doing that drive with my truck, Chad, I can just, you know, jump in the train and pitter-patter, right? I do have to pay attention to signals. I think they've been in before, Trent. We've just never used them. Leonard made them the other day. Oh, uh, chat. I, uh, I smelt in factory may have gotten a little taller. By a little, I mean, not a little. Several stories taller. Several stories taller. All right. Yeah, he grew a little bit. Yeah. Yeah. All right, we got to pay attention to chat because there's other trains zipping around right now. All right, I'm going to go around and park over here to my left is where I tend to park my work train, so. Yeah. Almost eight in it. That's not good, John. That could be a problem with 35 and slick pavement. That's not good. I do have two floors for steel. I'm output the I'm outputting 1440 uh, steel now, which I think is what Sarge's factory uses, right? I believe so, yeah. Like, if your factory's cranked up to full production, 1440, I believe so. Which I think that's the, the only place we're taking steel right now, right? Or no, Godi's using a little bit of steel. That's right. It is a lot of steel, yeah. Uh, so this is Sarge's steel factory. I don't know if chat has really seen this. I'm just going to park my train here for a minute. It might, it might hold up the whole world, but that's okay for a minute. Okay. Doesn't really hurt anything. This has grown a ton. So this is Star Sarge's steel factory. Um, so he's doing uh, beams, plate, or beams, oh, what's it? Beams, pipe, and encased beams. You're making all that, right? Oh, you know what? This has coal in it again, doesn't it? How did... What does? Right where I'm standing. Somebody uh, somebody from Denmark may have sent a coal train here the other day. And uh, if, you, if you notice... Yeah. If you notice, there might be some, uh, some coal... Um, where it doesn't belong. I heard that somebody spent four or two hours cleaning this up, but I guess it's still happening. Or there's a train with that's coming here that's not supposed to be coming here with coal in it. Not really sure. But uh, Mondays down here. It's the one that I'm on. It's the it's the storage bin. Um, let's see, second from the. From the east back here. Well, because I noticed these machines aren't doing anything. They're supposed to be making steel beams, but they have coal going to them. So obviously that's uh, obviously that's a problem. So. Yeah. Just delete it. You know, it works better just to delete the belt and and then replace the belt. Honestly. My inventory is kind of kind of chalked right now, chat. Why is that belt not working? Probably because there's still coal in here, right? Okay. So I spent like an hour the other day cleaning this up too, and I thought I had it all, but uh, apparently not.
Okay, so... Ah, wrong button. Chat, I hit the wrong button in this game more than any other game that I've ever played. Okay, so that's all working now. Uh, but there was... <laughs> there was so much coal in this factory, Sarge, the other day. It was, uh... It was kind of crazy, I'm not going to lie. Oh, you can change the offload to only accept a certain item? Really? I didn't know that. That's something I need to look into. I think it's just oh. remnants from the other day. Do what, Sarge? Oh. I think it's just remnant. Uh, this one. Sand camp, we usually use a uh, semi-tanker. For the record. Semi-tanker. Okay, so actually, let's go check this train back here real quick. The other side. I think it was just remnant, though, honestly. No, definitely shouldn't. Wouldn't be a bad idea at all to change it. Yeah, see, this is steel, and this is... I know where this train's coming from. This is, yeah, coming from... My giant monstrosity of... Oh, I'm, all the trains are blocked up right now. <laughs> Tat, my train's in the way. I like a little either. like a lot. <laughs> Alright, I think we're good now, Sarge, hopefully over here. Yeah, sand camp, you use the buy anything to a tanker is what we normally do. And I believe you, all your outputs are full by now too, right? Or almost full? Almost. Yeah. If it didn't get cold in here, it would have been full probably, like Saturday, but it's okay. Oh, actually, chat, we got to continue the tour. There's more tour. We'll have to go loop around through the roundabout because there, there's more tour to be had here, okay? Bear with me. I think we have a lot of traffic over here, though. <laughs> I think we have a lot of traffic. But we do have to watch their signals. That's something I, I tend to forget when I'm driving train on here. Like, I need to watch signals myself. If signals are red outside of this one here, this is the path. That's fine. But, like, you got to watch signals. It's a whole thing. Got to watch them. We even have a pink train trap. Got backed up at the roundabout. The only reason this is backed up is because I was backing up the trains over there. That's the only reason right now. For the record, this normally doesn't back up at all. The roundabout's actually really efficient. I made it into two blocks. So you can basically have like two trains in the roundabout at the same time. Pretty awesome. Not a bad idea, Yulberry. I think um, what really honestly happened is somebody from Denmark played like 10 hours Saturday and was very tired while they were setting stuff up. And like there were a few things where it was like, why are you doing that? You know? Oh, man. Where's the orange and bright green train? I didn't want to do green because Leonard already had a green train, so I chose to not do a green train. Uh, sand camp, for the record. So, yeah. Leonard already has one, so I didn't want to... I didn't want to play copycat, you know? All right, so we'll go over to Godi's, uh Some of Godi's factories over here, guys, to show you what's, what's cooking over here. All kinds of stuff. All kinds of stuff be cooking over here. All right. You need to slow it down. Slow it down. You can't. <laughs> Actually, I need to look at this factory, too. He asked me to work on this one, and I haven't, I haven't gotten around to it bring it up to efficiency but that's the factory that makes all the screws 
And then I believe this factory here is the steel plate factory. That's all it makes. No, Jacob, we never have. Uh, the last time we played this, we just had a uh, A to B train. It went from point to point. That was it. Oh, give us time, Jacob. I have ideas. I do have ideas, buddy. Traxxas, we're doing, man. How are you? Welcome in. Yeah, I have a bad idea. I don't even know if Sarge knows it, but I was talking to Leonard about it the other night. It's a bad idea, so... It's a really bad idea, but I'm okay with it. It's just going to be massive. Absolutely massive. Uh, so this is making, uh, what is it? Compressed coal? Is that a thing? I believe that's what Godi's making here. Not a ton, but you don't need a ton. Um, or we're just not going to load. Yeah, that's what he's doing here. Okay. Tactical. There you go. So that's what this is doing. And then uh, he's actually un or loading stuff in here. So sulfur and coal here. And then unloading it or loading it back on a train, I should say, up, up yonder. Possibly, Jacob, eventually, yeah. Possibly. So this is loading out. And then this is actually going down to a uh, fuel generation. Or uh, power, power seat, power plant eventually. Which we need more power. That's like a constant thing for us. We definitely need more power. Uh, but that's okay. That is all. Oh, I just realized you're riding with me, Sarge. How long have you been there? Oh, about a minute. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Okay. Gotta watch signals. Got to pay attention to signals. Now, the one thing I can't go from here and go south on the map right now. I need to put another ramp in. So, unfortunately, to go south, we actually have to go through the roundabout. So, it's kind of inefficient. I know I need to drop a ramp from, like, here somewhere and go to south down there past those iron mines would be uh would be good but we can just take a quick trip through the roundabout again we definitely need to go south y'all need to see that cody's done a ton of work down there in the past uh past couple days but the beautiful thing is there's nobody in the roundabout so we can fly we can fly I hope you see me. Oh, God. Oh, it didn't see me. Oh, no. I thought it was going to stop. <laughs> I thought it was going to stop. <laughs> I thought it was going to stop, but I guess not. <laughs> Don't worry, I hit the clip button. Don't worry. Don't worry, I got it set. Why didn't that stop? Hold on, we gotta we gotta check our blocks here. Oh, I was in the wrong. I should have stopped. Oh. It's all right, mate. <laughs> you can't park there, sir. <laughs> Dave, thanks for the bits. Appreciate you. Yeah, I was in the wrong. What else is new? You live, Sarge? You okay? Yep, I'm good. <laughs> Bebear0313 cheered Dex100. He said no one is in the roundabout so we can fly. Lol. You definitely flew. <laughs> I definitely did fly. <laughs> you mentioned Bear, thanks for the bits. Oh god, here comes another train. <laughs> well, it should stop because I'm in that block, so... All right, so next time I'm going to hit the roundabout with extreme caution, okay? Extreme caution, chat. Oh, man. Look at all the trains backed up, too. Oh, 
uh, which, you know, here in like 30 seconds, it'll all be clear. It's not a big deal. That was fun. And we, that was the worst derailment yet. Trenton Zach cheered X100, and based on review data, J, Hun is in the wrong. Wow. Thanks, Trent, for the bits. I think 14 people just clipped that, by the way, because I clipped it too. Oh, man. All right, so let's head south to chat like nothing ever happened. <laughs> Thanks for the follow. Appreciate you. Welcome in. How's it going? At least derailments are easy to clean up in this game, you know? You just hit E and you're good. Oh, actually. Oh, we could have gone south from there. We could have just gone around that way. That way. Forgot about that one. We didn't even have to do that, chat. Oh, well. happens. Content. Go ahead, Sarge. Content. Exactly. Hit the roundabout at 90 miles an hour for content. Yeah, Sarge, did you go flying like during that or what happened to you? Oh, I kind of... Yeah, went flying. on the ground down below. Okay. Chaz, this game is a ton of fun. It's very, uh, it can be a headache. But it is, uh, it's a lot of fun. I ran little... the tube through the water. Yeah, you like that? <laughs> yeah, it's a thing. It's not bad. All right, so this is um, Godie's. Oh, there's Godie's work train right there. So this is oil, uh, basically crude oil being refined to make plastic and rubber. And as of right now, I think all the plastic and rubber are actually being sent to an awesome sink. Because we don't actually need it anywhere right now. Um, yeah, here goes the rubber and here's the plastic underneath us being sent to awesome sink. Uh, but basically the whole purpose of this is actually to make power. So he is making uh, turbo fuel. Okay. He's making turbo fuel and eventually that turbo fuel is coming out here and powering uh, diesel generators. So thanks sand camp. So that's what this is. This is turbo fuel powered uh, generation generation now earlier today i unlocked an alt recipe um i unlocked an alt recipe that'll probably change this entire thing or we just make a different one uh which could be on the agenda for tonight of things to actually get done i unlocked the alt recipe for packaged fuel or dil diluted diluted packaged fuel whatever it's called i unlocked that today right so from my understanding, we basically take fuel, we package it and dil dilute it at the same time, right? And then basically, I think it doubles the fuel because it gives you, um, you're basically putting water in your fuel, which is kind of weird. Uh, but it gives you a lot more fuel than you unpack it, then turn it into turbo fuel and then burn it, I think. Not 100% sure on that one though, I'll be honest. But I think that's how it goes. So, we could possibly make a make a thing tonight because we need a ton of power. We we need to go nuclear, but like, yeah, I don't know about that yet, you know. So what I was thinking, I was looking at the map today, and actually I did some exploring today and added some more um, towers in. But we have, um, I thought there was two more spots. Where was I looking? There's some oil there, but there's a bunch of oil here. Now, I know they're not all pure and stuff, but that's fine. And I thought I was looking at another spot of oil somewhere, too. Maybe it was just that one. Technically, we're not using these these oils here, either. So there's, there's oil here we're not using. And there's oil down here we're not using. So, I was kind of thinking, like, maybe we make a place where we can do all that. You get twice as much back when you unpack it. Holy cow, you'll bury. So, that's what I was kind of thinking. Top of map north. Now, we haven't really gone to the north, Jacob. I haven't really gone to the north. So, I don't know if there's room maybe down here, like in this area back here in the water behind us. Just to make a fat facility. Or, maybe go over to the other edge of the map or something. I don't know. I haven't decided yet. But... I was kind of thinking about maybe we make a spot where we can actually load trains with oil. 
and haul crude oil with trains. Or maybe even we do the turbo fuel and then haul it and then burn it. I, I don't know. But I want to involve trains. We could just do it all in one big facility and be done with it, but what fun is that? We need to use trains. So that's that's my theory in life anyway. Bear doesn't have a fuel generator plan. That's Godie's, and I'm not I'm not touching Godie's build. No. Not touching his build. But I was thinking about maybe we set up a whole separate uh, thing tonight. I don't know. I don't know. What powers the trains? Uh, they're electric. Uh, Chaz, there's electric you run to the stations, and then the track carry power. So, yeah. That's what powers the trains. Oh, we're lagging. So this actually comes down to uh, copper, copper mines. It's, yeah, it tells you right at the bottom how much the train is currently using. Up to 150 megawatts, I believe. <laughs> exactly, John. <laughs> Mr. Showoff, what's up? How you doing today? There is a Kateria mine down there I want to get as well, since I already have a train station here for it. Basically, this is the end of the rail uh, here. So I'm just showing you guys all the stuff we've been up to since last Monday. You recycle the empty... Do you really, Uberry? That's kind of cool. Okay. Uh, definitely not a bit drunk. Kind of jelly there, uh, Mr. Shaw. So, Sarge, what do you think? You want to build a giant oil refinery to get a ton of fuel and then like package it up eventually yeah why not <laughs> that's what I'm thinking we send trains to get the oil and then haul it somewhere and I don't know I don't know uh, it's a bird it's a plane it's a flying thing I don't I don't know if it has a name my Fred maybe Uh, Mr. Shoff, I'm sorry you're uh, having a bad time. Uh, Sarge, where where do you want to build a refinery? That's the better question, I guess, right? Like, anywhere on the map, where do you want to build a refinery? Because that's going to... Where are we going to pull the oil from? Well, if you look at your map, um, east of us, next to that pond, there's, there's a lot of... They're not pure, uh, but... There's a lot of oil, and we can always turbocharge them up. Oh, there's a couple pure. There's yeah. Normal. And you know what? There's actually water there too. We could could do a bunch of the processing right there. Yeah. And then maybe haul it somewhere else to actually burn it. Yeah. Drink it off and go on the next day. I mean, something like that. Yeah. Yeah. A good place to me. All right, well, uh, let's, uh, I got to turn my train around and get back to that station. I can't back up because there could be a coal train coming behind us. We'll just go for a little train ride. We'll park down, uh, down at the copper mine there. All right. It's all right, Jacob. It only hurts my lungs. It doesn't hurt yours. Just saying. Here comes the coal train, I think. Pretty sure that's the coal train. Because the Caterium train is, uh, or whatever, is, uh, is, is stopped right now because my factory's full. Definitely full. Interesting, you'll bury. Okay. All right. Oh, Jacob. I don't want to know, bro. Oh, while we're up here real fast, I'll show you guys what I did to my uh, factory, and then we'll be done with uh, showing you what's new, I think. Outside of the aluminum thing, but 
don't think it's done, so we're not going to go over there yet. Maybe, maybe a little later. We'll just run up to the uh, to the to the thing here real fast, show you guys. Because why not? We all enjoy a good train ride, right? There's something. I don't know if it blows into my mouth. Jacob two thousand three hundred and forty-eight cheered X one hundred. Oh, the aluminium. Yes, the aluminium. Thanks for the bits, Jacob. Actually, we need some aluminium because then we can get like faster belts and a whole bunch of things. A whole bunch of other things. But that's alright for now. Like I said, it's all set up. There's just no output. I think all of it's being awesome synced right now. Wait, what's going on here? Why are we having an issue here? not having an issue okay it's just uh waiting to pull in the station here you gotta wait for one train has to wait for another train sometimes but not an issue I switch thank you so we have these run around tracks here i put these in for basically our work trains i work trains as much as i was working on this building i had to keep going yeah going and getting supplies Yeah. Wow. Haven't decided what I'm doing for factory walls yet. Those are basically just up there to uh, keep me from falling out of it when I was working on it. That's that's really the only reason those walls are up there, just so I didn't fall out of the factory. So. And I know I need a hyper tube. Don't you don't have to say it, chat. I know. Have I done it yet? No. Uh, so that's regular uh, uh, iron is what that floor is, which is not in use. Apparently, this is uh, steel number one. Yes, I said number one. This is copper, which again is currently not in use because we don't have anywhere for our copper to go. This is our criterion floor, which also is um, not currently in use because, well, it's full where that goes. Uh, and then this is steel number two. Yep, steel number two. Uh, it has two outputs now uh, for steel. So there's actually four outputs for steel. So each one of the train cars has its own uh, output, basically. So we're, we're feeding the train evenly now instead of uh, trying to keep the front train full or the front car. So it's all being filled now. So that's a whole thing. And then, while I was building last night, I have an extra floor. And an extra floor. <laughs> and then the roof. <laughs> but I figured, why not, like, why not have an extra floor, too? Because I'll probably end up using them eventually, right? I'll probably end up using them eventually. But it's cool to stand up here, because you got the roundabout, obviously. You got the track going off that way. That goes up to a coal mine. That track there goes to... Uh, basically the wire wire factory up there, Bears Wire Factory. And then that someone goes back to the homestead, which is kind of cool. Lonely, what's going on, man? Welcome in. How are you? And then over here. Exactly, Dave. Exactly. And then over here, you can see all Goaty's stuff over there. Sarge's factory. It's kind of cool being up this high in this game. And I mean, some of the trains almost this high, so. I don't know. It's kind of neat. And then my favorite part. There's only one way down, chat. Very efficient. Very efficient way to get down. But yeah. All right, we're going to go around the roundabout again. Had a great day at work. Awesome. Awesome. I had a pretty good day, too. Yeah, sometimes it gets me, Chaz. I won't lie. Sometimes by the time I get to, I'm down to the bottom, I'm like, all right, good. I'm down. Like, we're safe. I'm on the way down. I'm just thinking space bar, space bar, space bar. 
doesn't get more reliable than gravity. Exactly, Chuck. Yeah. Yeah, I'm just thinking space bar, space bar, space bar. Please, please, please. Gotta remember to hit it. Otherwise, I'm gonna splat. <laughs> exactly. Do you think that'd be a good launching point, Sarge, to go from down at the copper down there? Sure. Maybe actually just uh, back where those tracks split off, maybe. Yeah. Rain and flurries today. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Gravity check. That's awesome. That's awesome. All right, now we should be able to fly. Although last time I said that. Oh, didn't know that, Jacob. Did not know that. Right. Oh. I love when the cars like pass the train. Be looking like farm sim at that point. Bail challenge map where the bailers pass the tractor ship. Wow. Alright, Chaz. Alright. Okay, so maybe we'll where those tracks turn right sarge maybe we'll jump from there and go down to the oil i just hope i have enough supplies in this train i got all kinds of goodies in this train so hopefully hopefully we have enough enough otherwise we have a, a bit of a journey to get back to the homeland so uh john oh, yeah when works. when railroads updates i would love to play it again do what sarge but no worries. Yeah. Plug it either way. Uh, Railroads is switching to Unreal 5, uh, John, and they're adding like a day night cycle and all kinds of stuff. It's available in the like beta update, but uh, I'm kind of into Satisfactory right now, you know? So maybe uh, eventually, yeah, we'll, we'll play Railroads again. You betcha. I'm not done with that game at all. Definitely not done with that game, but the day night cycle should be really fun. And the ability, it has the ability to adjust the day-night cycle, so you can have a, a minute of nighttime if you want. And 20 minutes of daytime or something. It's always night, Jacob. Always. Doesn't matter what game I play, it's always nighttime. Or actually, would it be better to jump off that line below us, Sarge, to go straight under? Because basically we need to go straight where we're at now probably straight east probably would be better okay uh if we park here though we're out of let's get out of the train uh can we get a train line through here though i guess is the question and by the way chat new mouse scroll wheel works great it's so much better to play this game now uh, just saying. Everything just works so much better with a scroll wheel that's functional. Well, if we go over and then, yeah, we can make it here. We can do it. Be like uh, double decker trains right here. Kind of. That, that seems like it'll be okay, right? Look at this guy to my right. I don't know which right you're talking about, Jacob. That thing or that? Either way, man, the sky in this game is incredible. You could just make like a like a live desktop background and have it that right there all day. I'd be okay with that. Just saying. All right, so we need some foundations. 
problem is we have to go up just a little and then oh, track might get kind of interesting. That's okay. That's all right. All right. Mm -hmm. Looks better than No Man's Sky Sky. Okay. Never seen that game. Never, never actually seen that one. Oh, yeah. Well, you just want to go, uh, Sky, Sky Train, Sarge? Oh, Jim, for now. We'll have to put support set eventually. Cool. Almost fell off that. And then, actually, Goaty put a, there's a sulfur mine up there. And you talk about floaty trains. That's gonna, we're gonna have to work on that one. It's actually left hand, left hand traffic for a little while too. And it's like, oh, oh what? But it's all right. We'll fix it up eventually. And this is gonna be quite a sky bridge here. But you know, it's good straight track, nice and level for now. Somehow we got to get around, around the mountain. I see brain slugs too. That's okay. <laughs> exactly, Chuck. Exactly. Let's jump back up a little bit, Sarge. I'm going to 45 it to the right. We're going to go through that tunnel over there, okay? And one more. What we're doing. We're going to make it through there. Well, it might be awkward, but we're going to do it. Might be a little awkward. That's okay. A roundabout around the rock, we could. Let's see, are we going to be able to get another train through here, though? We're not. We're going to have to move this over a little bit more, okay? That's uh, not a problem. Alright, let's just go back to here. We'll make that one the left train. Like the the train back here. We'll just do that for now. All right. And I like to keep my trains uh, separated. I don't know about anybody else, but I sure like to keep them a little bit separated. see that's too far over so it has to be here come on we're working on the right hand train though mostly not the left train do that one later. They are so high up over the world right now. This is kind of crazy. I was exploring today, and I've seen parts of this map. I saw parts of this map today that I have never seen before. It was kind of crazy. Of course, if you actually go look at my... Uh, like the last map I played compared to this map, and you show, like, look at the actual maps. It's like night and day. 
we didn't explore anything on my other maps compared to uh what I've what we've explored on here. It's crazy how much we've explored on here compared to that map. Um, I want the brain slug. My inventory. Oh. Cool. Want the. Give me the brain slug. Got three down. Oh, I poked my head in the desert today there, Jacob. Thank you. I did. I I poked my head out into the desert today just for uh just for a minute or two. Yeah. Why can't we go there we go. That's gonna cause a problem though, isn't it? Yeah, I did just just for a minute today. I uh, poked my head out there just to see. Like I said, I explored a bunch today on this map. I really did. Wait, can I cut these things down? Cut this down. Oh, we can't, can we? Of course, our trains are gonna. We can't have that. Need explosives. You want a train to go right through there, Sarge? go like this we just go over one your stars jump off those other ones on your left there we'll bring the other train back on the other side it'll be magical that's all this those uh the geothermal things Is that what those are i think so yeah it's fine Uh, we're not getting like close though, are we? <laughs> no. Not at all. Geysers, that's the word. Like, I know it's there's a word for that, but uh, yeah, geysers. You know. I'm gonna be honest, I don't really like the sky trade idea, but like if we didn't it would take us years to uh years to build this out, so you know. Sky train it is. Oh Sarge, you have any concrete on you? Yeah. I'm gonna take over building, I'm out of concrete. Time to sip some coffee. I think we're getting close though, because this is the pond. This is the water that's on this the other side of the all that oil. So yeah, we're getting there, guys. Like I said, I explored a bunch today and put out uh, two. I think I did two towers, three towers. I think I did three, and then I ran out of materials. So. I was going to do more, but that's all right. It happens. Oh, I did find a couple hard drives today, which we've already talked about all that, all that. So good there. Like there's a crash site coming up there too. So I'm, I feel like, you know what? Maybe I feel like we've, I've been to this one before though. Not like on the server though. I can't pass, but I could be wrong. Are you out of concrete? 
No, I was looking around. Yeah. At some point here, we're going to have to nosedive, but I think we need to get around these rocks and then we'll nosedive. I think is what the plan's going to be. I don't know. I know that we're kind of in the thick of it right now, but that's all right. Because, you know, it looks like the edge of the world down there, but it's totally not. I kind of want to go down there and get that one. That is going to require power, though. It'd be wrong. Yeah. All right, we're doing it. He's power. Yeah, I ain't got no power down here. I think we're going around this way. I'll be able to make that start it. I let my jetpack charge up first. Does it work if you don't let it charge up? Oh, that's a good point, Bear. I always forget about that. I, I legitimately every single time I forget about it. Hey, Sarge, when you hear the power grid break, it's not actually the power grid breaking, okay? Like that. Oh, yeah, it does take. You're right. Okay, hold on. Fine. That's. <coughs> Hang on. Oh, I guess we have to connect them both. Uh, we can't just run the line there. Okay. You see where we're going? Yeah, it went too far. No. That requires 42. How much does this thing make? 30. That took entirely too long. All right, I have a hard drive charge. No, I didn't break the main power system again. Where? You went too far by how far? Uh, a little wait bit. A I'll wait till you get up here and. Okay. Uh, I'm at the end of your ramp. You say you went to where? Wait, oh, is it? Oh, wait, where are these oil things at? Uh, pretty much below where I'm standing. I don't want to jump off, but I know I kind of need to, right? Uh, you don't want to. Why not? Um, there's a world down there, right? Oh. Oh, no, there's not. No, no, there's not. Okay, wait, I'm looking at the... I thought I was the other guy. I thought I was the other guy. I thought I was the pink, the pink one. I'm the orange guy. Yeah. <laughs> I, looked at, I was looking at the wrong guy, chat. <laughs> All right, I got him on my way. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't have died right there. All right, I don't know if I can make it to you, but I'm trying. Alright, um, so I guess we should probably go back across the water then somewhere. Um, where are they actually at, though? Be like right underneath us, right? They're north. Oh, there they are. Okay, there's one there, and there's one there. Yeah, okay. 
So what? We go back across the water and then like. I'd say back up a little bit and then start going down. Like uh, <clears throat> pretty much all the way across, right? Yep, yep. I get you to get off that chunk of foundation. Oh man, I was I was looking at the wrong guy on the map, guys. That's all it was. Buddy. There's another. Is that another crash site down there? Maybe. Kind of looks like it. All right. Yeah. The question is, how far back do we want to go? This is some weird looking terrain out here, isn't it? Oh, there's one of those towers, by the way, I put up earlier. I love them. Okay, well, that didn't... What's up? I have foundation that didn't... Oh, really? I see it out there. Did you mark more than 50? Yeah, I did. Yeah, I did. <laughs> I don't know. I'll uh, I'll go take care of it. Oh, it's not there. It's not there. It's it's a mirage. <laughs> uh, so it did disappear, Sarge. You were just too far away to see it disappear, but it's not there. Okay. <laughs> uh, this is where I got I die, chat. <laughs> I'm not going to make it back to you, am I? Never mind. Alright. How far back do you think? I, we probably need to go, like, all the way across the water. Honestly. Start marking and you... Like, ah. way... Way back here, because, you know, we don't slope it too aggressive, because then we'll never make it back out of this area, you know? Uh, the problem is I'm out of concrete. Can't really help. Or sorry, I have one concrete on me. But I have jetpack fuel, guys. Lots of jetpack fuel. <laughs> you betcha. All right, I might have jumped off. Well, maybe that's not a, a crash site. It's just some rocks. This is strange territory over here, y'all. I don't like it. Weird. Harvest it. No, you can't make me. Love some Instawars. That is a good mod, isn't it, San? <laughs> Absolutely not, Chuck. I would never spill... I would never spill the coffee. Oh, I don't have a cable. Maybe we should work How on... steep should I be coming down? I usually run the uh, the two, Sarge. Okay. I feel like that's pretty good for trains to climb back up, you know? Oh. Um, yeah. It's okay, Jacob. It's okay. Oh. Don't drink this water, okay? <laughs> this water is not okay. <laughs> this water is na We're not using this water. This water is gross. This is sewage. <laughs> Sarge, I think you might need to back up before you start coming down, to be honest. Just kind of looking at it from down here. Might have to back oh. up even more. I have a suit on. Ended up in Michigan. Into the mud bed. Oh, is wait, what's in my coffee cup now, Chad? Is it coffee or is it? Oh, never mind. All right, we'll collect some brain slugs while uh, Sarge does that ramp. Don't worry, the spiders won't hurt me anymore. Not a fan of the spiders. I turned them off. Made all my mobs, mobs like passive. I don't have any issues anymore. 
And look at the brain slugs in here. Got brain slugs everywhere, chat. Oh man. They're everywhere. Cool. Let's go. Your contract legally compels you to harvest this artifact. It has to be coffee. Oh, uh, it's sewage water, y'all. Sewage water. Nasty. Uh, so, Chaz, you can take these and you turn them into power shards. And basically what they do is all of your factories and stuff, all of your assemblers and basically anything that runs a mine, everything, uh, you can basically power them up. Each one can take up to three uh, power shards in there and it just makes stuff run faster. Man, they're everywhere in here, chat. Uh, makes stuff run faster. So like a mine, instead of only pulling, say, 120, you can crank that sucker up and uh, it's pretty cool, actually. So you can use less less buildings and get more uh, more productivity basically out of the same building. So it's kind of a neat way. We're just like, I just need a little bit more iron ore. Well, I'll just go to a mine and turn it up a little bit instead of uh, instead of building a whole nother mine. You know, kind of kind of what they're used for. And you just have to find them. Another one there. And we have, like, tons extra right now. Tons extra. Tons, 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 tons. We have a lot of extra ones right now, but never hurts to have more. Sarge, that looks good. Yeah. We get maybe just a little closer to the water, and then we'll make a flat area for trains. Or actually, I really just want to run. I'm going to run back to the train. I can grab stuff. Trent, enjoy your uh, dinner and feeding uh, Tony. We'll catch you, bro. Because, let's see. All those are right. Yeah. Those two will have to. We can pipe those down to here. And then these other four. I mean, we might as well. Try to get everything right. All right, I'm gonna go. Um, I'm actually gonna work on getting a train track out here. I think. How about that? Because then yep. I can just drive the train, and that way we have supplies. Um, train. So we'll just do the old uh, start the train track, and I don't actually have a ton of steel beam on me, so. Build as far as we can. Build as far as we can. All right. So eventually this will all be dual track uh, chat. Dual track. We like our dual track. Or I do anyway. I don't know about anybody else, but I sure like it. There's a brain slug up there too, isn't there? I'll have to go get it before we get out of here. These guys are great to hunt at night because, like, they light up. <laughs> They're really easy to see at night. Don't forget a to-do list for what bear. That'll work. Yeah, it'll work. This is going to be a good straight up track. Just, you know, nothing holding it back. Except for maybe some swamp water. That's all right. Not a big deal. Thanks for the follow. Appreciate you. Welcome in. How's it going? All right.
Right, nice quarters, nice quarters. Got to do the straights first, you know. Do the quarters second. So we are uh, working on a train line um, to go kind of far. The theory of our map uh, is trains everywhere. And uh, that's exactly what we're working on. So right now we are going to go and connect a train line that's at this train here. And we're going to be running all the way over to this oil here. That's what we're working on right now. So that's what we're up to. Oh, that's true. That's true, Bear. I, I, I guarantee I don't have the material on me, but I, I'm going to get my train, so. The first step's going to be train, and then we'll do uh, the extractors. And probably going to need a couple trains on this, because, uh, yeah. Although we haven't actually picked where we're building the refinery yet. So. Yeah, we'll figure that out later. You're not the only one, Zane Camp. Not the only one, man. We are currently working on a train line that goes from this train right here over to this oil in this area. We're going to be shipping this oil somewhere. Haven't decided where yet to build a uh, giant refinery. And I know that we should just put the refinery there, but I don't want to. So we're not doing it there. Oh, so, yeah. Live by a train, Chaz. Nice. Got a train we can hear from the house here, too. It's not, like, super close, but it, it gets loud sometimes, depending on the, the weather and, you know dense the air is that kind of stuff deja vu. pretty much you'll bury deja vu it happens it happens all right i'm thinking like somewhere out here where it's like Kind of flatter, kind of nice, you know. Over there is just kind of like the barren wasteland, in my opinion. I'm not a fan of that just area of the map. You know, we could bring a train, you know, or maybe a couple trains of just oil over here. Or maybe, I don't know. I don't know. I haven't decided yet what we're doing exactly. Like, do we put a bunch of water pumps somewhere and pump water and put it on a train? And just build a fat refinery like over there. I don't know. <laughs> Haven't decided yet, chat. I could actually see building in this area. This is where I had my last map. This is like where everything was in our last map. I like this area a lot. Not so much up here. But like down here. This area right here. This is this is my kind of my kind of area on the map. I like this area a lot. Oh, yeah. I'm actually shocked. I'm going to be able to make it back to my train. Well, that's good. I'm sure you're in need of some supplies as well, Sarge, by now, right? Yeah, about to, yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, I'll be hooking up to the, uh, to the train here in just a second, and then I can... Uh, get the train down to you. Oh, yeah. That's clean. I like it. I like it. All right, now we just need to check for the coal train. Uh, yes, Saint Camp. It doesn't matter what chainsaw. You just double tap Alt to turn on Lumberjack. 
we're good to go for a little bit here. There's no trains near us. Gotta back up and switch tracks here real quick. Yet to build any trains or transport for that matter. The trains are so much fun in my opinion. I really, really, really enjoy the trains. So, kind of my thing. Of course, I also play a game called Railroads Online, which is train building. Uh, so I, I like trains. I've played, uh, oh, what's the other game? Transport Fever 2, that's all trains. No, I, I like, uh, I like, I like trains chat, right? Yeah, I could see like, just, yeah, building a fat refinery out here somewhere. So yeah, could be a good time chat. Oh, there's definitely railroad games. Lots of, there's all kinds of railroading, uh, railroading games. All right, Sarge, does that track just dead end on there still? Yeah. All right. Just, just. All right. At least we'll have our material train with us. Did I leave you behind or are you with me? Um... Left behind, going in hard landing, out. <laughs> okay. Yep, we're good. Yeah, d Rob value, that's, that is another one, yeah. Yep, yep, yep. I don't know, Bear. I don't, I don't know on the fluid trains yet. I'm aware that this is probably a really bad idea, but... You know. YOLO, right? I did derail. I, I did, yeah. It was the whole thing. And don't worry, chat, we don't we won't derail here. We'll just you know. That was perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay, so how many are there total here? Four, five, six. We have six chat total. Uh, so if we want to put, say, six on here, and like Bear was saying, we just come back to our little uh, train cars here, and we can grab uh, some material. I want to dump off some of this fuel, though. I got too much fuel on me. That's my little electrical... Are. Here we go. Why do I have so much fuel on me, chat? Just because I do, okay? Uh, okay, I need some encased beams and cable. And I hope I have both on this train. Do I have any encased beams, Sarge? you see any on here? That's all steel plate and silica. That's not good. Oh, I've got some. Do you have like 120? Um, I have got. Cause then we'll I'll have enough materials to make all six of them. I only got 90. Okay. I come here, please. If you don't mind. But using the fluid ones is cooler. See, Ninja, Ninja, now you're on my kind of, you know? Using the f moving... Uh-huh, yeah. Dude. Uh, Bear was asking about the tankers, guys. That's what he was asking. The tankers. I did not build one extractor. I didn't have the material. Oh, I did build one extractor. Dang it, Bobby. Did I? There's something over here. 
Or there maybe there's not. Maybe I'm seeing things. Seeing things. Don't mind me, chat. All right. Um. So everything kind of needs to point that away. Hard parts fine. Here's one here. Okay. You go up that way to one more. Rats. Okay, over here somewhere. Kind of hard finding them all, chat. No, I didn't have uh, stuff on me, Jacob. And somewhere might be a bit of a hike, though. That way. Back through. I don't know if I want to go through or go over. Who's going to take me around? So we're going over. This is why I have so much jetpack fuel on me, chat. Maybe we'll go through this cave. Is this a cave to nowhere? Cave to nowhere. Kind of sad. Fun climb. All right. Keep on climbing. There's going to be some pipes running out here. Chat's going to be crazy. played it in 2019 and used cheats yeah we're not using any mods or cheats or anything I don't really enjoy games when uh, well it's outside of like farm sim with mods obviously farm sims fine with mods but oh, a game like this doesn't need them in my opinion where the heck are these oil oh god I'm just trying to run right now, chat. Or that way. Oh, we have, uh oh, we have train problem, Sarge? Oh, why? Uh, we do. I don't know why, but there's a train problem. Uh, that's back. Oh, you know what? I didn't put signals on that track. Oh well. See it flashing on, on top of your map? Supply. How close are we to it? Hit. Relaying message. Hello, this is Paternal Figure. I have taken this ill way. and need your help to find a cure. Doctors say that the only remedy... Why are these so tricky to find, chat? I, I, they gotta be below me, right? Or below me. They gotta be. They're not gonna be this high up in the in the world here, right? Comply. Arj, I got two I can't find. Hmm. Definitely not this way. Oh, right there. Oh, they're in the... Wait, is this the power slug cave that I was already in? No. We're going to say no, chat, for my my own mental sake, okay? Wow, this is a place I've never been, chat. Look at this. Wow. I think it was the cave, actually. It's okay, though. It's fine. Everything is fine, chat. What am I out of now? Am I out of concrete? Read again. For a bit of that's definitely not the same cave, no. No, it's not the same cave, no. Hmm. Might be the cave, dang it. Sarge, I like the wall you put at the end of the track. 
I'd have had the right stuff there would have been a sign on it. Just... Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I like it. I like it. It might be. Is that? Is it? It is the same cave, isn't it? No, that was over there. It was that cave. That was the cave. Might be the same one. <sighs> okay. It happens, chat. It happens. Alright. All right, so for right now, we'll just put this over here. Okay. Uh, I think there's one more I didn't get power to, though. I did definitely, definitely, definitely did not get power over there, did I? Nope. Okay, just don't work. That's cool, too. All right, we have power to all the oil extractors. Power to all of them. Uh, power poles, yes. There, there's a certain distance between the power poles. Uh, Sand Camp, the other way we're moving power is the, um, the track. The track is moving a ton of power. So, or it'll move whatever, whatever you need it to move, you know? Building in a swamp over here, chat. Jesus, gross. I don't like it. Let's see, how big of an area do you think we need over here, Sarge? Oh, gee. All we're doing is loading a train. That's oh. Or loading. Yeah, you know what I mean. We're just going to haul the oil somewhere else, and then we'll... Uh... <coughs> Or you think that's a bad idea? No, I'm good with it. All right. Do I ever play Farm Sim 22 anymore? About, uh, what? 20, Three days a week. 22 hours a week. Yes. On stream. I play 22 hours a week. Of uh, 22 on stream. Hmm. Grant to start here a while. Bam. Um. Yeah, I don't know if we're going to have... We might need to back that hill up some more, Sarge, actually. As bad as that sounds. Are we turn this and go that way with it? And then loop back around because we got to go up with our other track yet, right? Yeah, we do. Yeah, and the other track's going to be on this side here. This is where our other track's going to be. Uh, just for a visual reference right now. Not necessarily right there, but like, you know, right there. So. Must be you playing baseball games all week. I gotcha. Uh, so Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays, all days at noon. Uh, pretty much play uh, farm sim. Yeah. All right. So what if we run a whole bunch of this out this way, and then because nothing says we have room on the other end to go up just at a different uh, spot, right? I think we have lots of room to do that. So train station. And actually, we just started a new map uh, the other day, Saturday. Your contract legally compels you to harvest this. Started uh, Stevie's new uh, Four Lakes map. It's really cool. It's really neat. I like it so far a lot. Comply. Oh no. On the swamp water. Yeah. It's 
to power out of motors. Then was a black. It was. No, that map's been really fun so far. Yeah, and then Sergeant, you want to? You got concrete? Yeah, pretty much. We'll bring the train down, loop it into here, and then just straight up the hill. I gotta work. I might have to redo this though a little bit. I forgot to honk before backing up chat. My apologies. Yeah, let's redo this piece. Don't know if I'm going to be able to make this turn, but we're going to try. I don't think it's going to, well, that's going to be too tight, isn't it? Died of a turn. Hoping it was gonna work, but we'll have to stand over here a little bit. I don't like walking on this foundation right now because you hear the the splash of the of the water. It's kind of gross. I don't like it. There we go. That'll work. Our foundation is just right at the water level. A honking wall reverse is a must. Okay. Okay, so then I can take out a bunch of this. Beautiful, beautiful. No, this is figure. I have taken ill and need your help to find a cure. Doctors say that the only remedy is alien artifacts. Just too far. Alright, now technically this has power, so it will start pumping. Okay. Um, let's see, let's work on this end. Harvest it. So we're gonna go ahead. We have what do we have? Here. So we want to divide them up because we're Probably gonna need both. We're gonna put in some storage tanks as well. So that they can keep pumping even when the train's here loading. You are so lucky that you found I feel like that makes sense, right? Artifact. We're going for maximum maximum speed here is what we're trying to achieve, you see. Or something like that. Wait. Okay. Why are those? Why are those that color? I kind of want to make this all. Black piping because like, you know, crude oil, right? Okay, why? Why does that keep doing that? I don't like, I don't. 
Um, I don't actually know why it's doing that, but that's all right. Lonely, have a good night. We'll catch you later. Thanks for hanging out. Have a good day at work tomorrow as well. Have a good day. Trent, welcome back. Oh. Ew. Ew. So if I just like do this and this and then it should not make it that ugly color. Is that what we're getting at, chat? Ah. How much separation do you keep? How much sep two. separation for what, Sarge? Say that again. Correct. One or two. I like to keep one. One one okay. open square between. That makes sense? Yep. All right. Cool, cool. All right. Changes with all pipes made that color. Okay. I got you. I got it now, chat. I didn't realize it was all set up that way. That's okay. Back. Got it. Does anybody else just like randomly fall in the water a lot or just like hit the wrong button in this game a million times? Because. Boy, I sure do. <laughs> I sure do. No. All right. All right. All right. You know what? We should make. Can we make these stations blank too, chat? Just jump out of tractors. Fair play, Sand Camp. You do. Oh, we can make all this. Oh, no. Wait a minute. Can we paint the track? I don't know what that did. That didn't do anything. Okay. Can't do that. All right. I was like, wait a minute. That'd be kind of sick if you could. Tired of falling into water. Build more foundation. How about that now? Well, I gotta change that too. Okay. Um, you need two first. Now, I'm not necessarily going to hook up all this. I know, but uh, that's okay. Or maybe I will. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. There's a mod that allows you to paint the track as I'm not surprised. There's a mod for everything. There's literally a mod for everything in this game, apparently. But that's all right. It's all good. Didn't I paint those already, chat? Picking up multiple fix it personnel in the area. Proceed with harvest before it's too late. Stay painted. Although, you know, honestly, I might as well hook these all up to everything, right? Because, like. If there's fluid, we want it to be flowing, right? Like, for speed reasons, I guess it makes sense, right? Maybe? I don't know. Y'all probably tell me, no, don't do it like that, but, you know. It's done like that. <laughs> uh, oh, goodness. Jetpack. Oh, miss. 
Mr. Plow. That's my name, that name again is Mr. Plow. Trent and Zach cheered X100. Don't do it like that, John. Thanks, Trent, I will. Uh, Muggy, I, yeah, I hear you. Then when you think you can make it with the jetpack and then you just can't quite... You just can't quite make it. It definitely happens, man. Definitely happens. Don't do it like that. What if I want to, Trent? Can I? Yeah, there. You know what? We're just gonna do that, chat. We're gonna change these. Uh, change them out to those. Cause I don't like the indicator things anyway. I like that look of that pipe better. Much better. Much better, in my opinion. Much better. B Bear 0313 cheered Dex 100. Don't forget about storage, John. Oh, yeah, storage. Good point, Bear. Right here would be good for storage, probably. Bear, thanks for the bits. Uh, uh, what's that under? Is that organization? By golly, George, it is. We stack these? Oh. A fluid tank on top of a fluid tank? No way. User joined your channel. Leonard, I'm not doing it wrong, I swear. Doing what wrong? Everything. Oh. Uh oh. Uh, do you see we have an aluminum ingot factory? I, I did, but is it hooked up to anything or is it just like sinking? So, well. It is just sinking, but like I've got a conveyor belt like floor deal right mm -hmm. there by the train station, mm -hmm. and I just didn't hook it up because I didn't know what train we we're going to use and what what cars it needed and all that. Uh, okay, that's fine. Fine. Uh, we're working on pow well eventually oil. I'm going to train oil, and I know that's not a good thing to do, but you know what? We can package it and train it though, right? We're going to do it loose. Is that okay? I mean, it's okay, but you want it? Should it, we package it first? Well, have you looked at the capacity of a? Oil, no, like a I haven't car? actually. It's I haven't. Like sixteen hundred, whatever. Uh huh. Like it's literally like a third of what you could haul if you packaged it and hauled it. So I guess maybe that's not an issue. But should we package it first? Is that what you're saying? What's, what's our output going to be? Do what? What's the output of our like our factory gonna be? I don't know. Oh, well, I don't know either. We're just we're okay. Let's put it this way. Um, I explored today and I found there's five uh oil uh things. Oh right? yeah, yeah. That I found and I'm like, hey, let's let's go just like haul that oil. And then like we'll build a factory somewhere else. We haven't gotten to that part yet. Am I doing things backwards? Probably, yeah. But I do I have the so. diluted uh, package fuel uh, recipe. I got that today. Diluted package fuel? Nice. Yeah. Yeah. Isn't that what it's called? Oh, that's true. If we package the oil here, we'll need the, the we'll need a ton of plastic, right? Oh, uh, that is true. So. Well, nothing says we have to run one train either. We could run multiple trains, right? Like, crank up some trains and let it let it eat, right? What recipe did you get? The uh, the diluted fuel. Where you add the water to the to the fuel, and then it basically doubles your fuel, right? What? Is that not a thing? I don't know. I'm pretty sure. Uh, Yulberry said it was great because it like doubles your fuel basically. You know what I'm talking I'm about? Just, you don't know what I'm talking I mean, about. I'm just looking at the fuel recipes and I just don't see it. Uh, go to a packager. Oh, there it is. Oh. It's under, it's under the, the packager thing. Oh, so instead of, oh, it, oh, oh, 
Oh, oh, oh, oh. That's yeah. That's a horse of a different color. And then you unpack it, and boom, you have double the fuel, right? Well, that turns it to fuel and package. Yeah, I think that's really good. We like that for us. Yeah, you're welcome. I think that's a good recipe, right? I, I, I dig it. Yeah. So the theory is we're going to, because Goaty got his factory going today, right? His like oil refinery thing. It's like fully functional. Okay. But heavy oil plus package fuel. No, I don't know. Uh, But if you notice, we're still like way short on power, right? So I was like, well, let's, let's change that. Let's get some more oil because, you know, we can always use more oil, right? Like we'll find right. a way to smelt it, even if we're just taking the field, the the plastic and the rubber, or just plastic or just rubber, whatever, and sinking all of it. Who cares? Yeah. So, because we need power. That or we go nuclear, but that scares me. <laughs> that scares me. I won't even lie. Packaged water, yeah. Exactly. Exactly. Can we get this up to here? You betcha. Might need some pumps in line, but for right now, we're not worried about that yet. We're not worried about it. It's fine. So, I, I saw a video the other day, and I don't know, like, how to make this happen, but I think it's a really good idea. This okay. person I was watching basically has a train that just goes around the map and just, like, drops off, like, you know, iron plate, copper sheet, like, all the materials we use to build a lot, mm -hmm. just at, like, different parts of the map and just... Running and refilling. Okay. What do you mean? Like that we it's just one train that Like it goes to like it would go like right now for say, you know, it would come here to the home base and just pick up, you know, <clears throat> a bunch of like normal materials that we use all the time to build. Right? Okay. And then go somewhere on the map and drop it off. And then come back and pick up more, go somewhere else, drop it off. I gotcha. I gotcha. So to go refill our inventory, we don't have to run. Oh, basically a sub, like a building supply train. Yeah. I'm catching what you're dropping now. Okay. Interesting. I do like the parking spot. Everybody said they liked it. I showed it at the start of stream. Oh, well, good. Parking lot. Plus, uh, honestly, where we're at on the map, I don't like this area. It's it's kind of creepy. I'm gonna Where's go where at? it's like, huh? Oh, you're. Oh, I see where you're we're at. Like we're like way down yonder, down here. Yeah. And I'm thinking we go down like by those copper mines down south. Like that's kind of a flatter, a nicer, nicer land, you know. Copper mines down south. Huh? Like over the water. Are you talking about like the like the initial like starting spot, like, like where we start. started on the other map. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But like this whole area down here is like open for um, activities. We'll say. Okay. Gotcha. Gotcha. Okay. At least he's got me, chat. That is good. Wait, this is not our cave. This is the wrong cave. Yeah, southeast. That direction. Okay. That direction, chap. Uh, we will need water. Yeah, eventually. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Eventually. Oh, dang it, Bobby. That's not what I wanted to do. Uh, can we just put this in here and run that right to there? All oh, right through the power pole. Yeah, I'm here for that. Uh, you know what? Yeah, we'll just keep using those same. Hmm, this one. Oh, the same, the same. Um, licorice candy can. We've been on this save for a couple weeks now. 
I can't tell you how we have probably I bet we're pushing a couple 200 hours and that's like not uh it's kind of a weird measurement because that's just when there's people in here that doesn't necessarily mean that like right now with two or I don't know is Leonard you in here two or three of us in yep. here it doesn't count the hours you know it just counts it for basically a person so kind of a whole thing So yeah. Uh, all right, Chad. I think we need to do some math, maybe here, huh? We need me to do. Um, make an oil refinery. <laughs> all right. Uh, we'll come in. <laughs> I guess, right? Yeah. I mean, at some point here. Uh, so what are we getting? We're getting two forty. I might, I don't want to overload, uh, these pipes handle what? Six, six, six under chat. And we can always crank these up too. We can always, uh, we can always, always, always add more to it. If we really wanted to. You have rails built all the way there. Uh, we do. I will warn you. Why? Where the copper and the coal mine trains split off kind of where Sarge is at right now, there is an issue with trains, and I think it's because I didn't put signals in. Uh, but yes, you can roll on a train pretty far. Or if Sarge can throw a signal in maybe or, and get those trains running, I don't know. I can try to. Okay. I haven't been back over there in a, in a minute trying to fix them. Uh, so let's see. What is this one doing? Though? This is 120. I just, I just, out. Oh, I messed that up completely. Uh, what we had two two forties, right, Chant? Okay, and then one twenty. So that's six hundred right there. We cannot put any more through that line, which is fine. So that other one's gonna have to connect to the other, the other line. Oh, come on. Oh, beautiful. That's just a, a thing of beauty right there, right? Oh, man. What are these two? I wasn't paying attention before. Uh, this is a 240 again. Dang. Lots of 240s. And I got to do a hard drive we're done tonight as well. Gotta get a hard drive researched at some point. Do it right there. Right where? Where you're at. I don't have a thing. Build a man. Oh, I can build one. Okay, so this is only 60, so we're gonna we're gonna turbocharge this one up, because why not? We're gonna we're gonna make this one like turbo. Where do I go from the roundabout? Uh, roundabout? You go through the west and then south when you can. Like, go through my thing. My, my factory. Yeah. Okay. So... Eleven hundred and ten oil total. 1110 crude. That's our number we have to work with, okay? That's not a bad number, right? Maybe. Oh no. That's how much we're producing out here, chat. It's just that short, y'all. Yeah. Twelve hundred would be better. 
Uh, we could turn... Yeah, that's true. We can turn up one a little bit more. I guess. We could turn... Let's see, which pipe does that need to go to? That top pipe. We could turn up um, one of these other ones on this top pipe a little bit. To get us up to... 1200. If we turn it up by 90... We can do that, right? Maybe. Matter. I mean, we could. We don't have to, but we could. I have the, you know, might as well. Uh, so what do we want that to be? How much are we turning this up by? David Moon 5, what's going on? How are you? Welcome in. Just how I like to play chat. Just turn it up. Turbo charge them all, chat. Turbo charge them all. That's how Goaty likes to do it, too. If you ever go in a Goaty factory, everything's turbocharged. Pretty awesome, actually. Okay, so we're going to need some pumps because we're not really getting um, our fluid here. Like, at all. Okay. Which, I figured we would need some pumps, but that's fine. We have Mark II pumps, too. Uh, that'll be more than plenty there. Found the signal that's not happy. You found it? Yeah, the... Yeah. Like I said, I just... I didn't put... Uh, I didn't put signals on this track. It is just a one one-way track right now. And my train's parked on a big downhill on it, so... Don't run me over too much. Oh, you'll have to watch a clip later, uh, Leonard. Okay. <laughs> But I might have had a catastrophic derailment earlier. Nice. Yeah. It was, uh. Oh, it, that's the problem. Okay. It was something. What's up, Sarge? I need material. Oh. Uh, you're welcome to anything that's in my train. Definitely welcome to it. Okay, so we are getting fluid. We'll still need some more pumps, I think, chat. All 14 Why? of them. It was like the Hindenburg. Uh, it was definitely... It was definitely something, that's for sure. Found your train, not gonna guarantee I can stop. That's all right. <laughs> How is there... Oh, oh yeah. Collision. Hey, where's that? Oh, that's the one from earlier. Oh, my God. I just saw train cars flying. <laughs> well, we're good. Uh, Nothing happened. Oh, man. Literally saw train cars flying. That was me. I feel like we should probably put a pump here, too, to really turbocharge this up, right? Uh, pumps never hurt, right, chat? Don't look at my my work; it's real pretty. Okay, looks fine. Looks great, right? Okay, so we should be we should be pumping at least 1,200 here now, which 1,200 is all we can do because of you know pipes. Yeah. Oh, remember when I said, like, oh, we're not getting much through here. That's because it's filling the train thing. I think we're done out here, right? That's kind of... I don't know what else we need out here. Right? I think we're done, right? Picking up multiple fix-it personnel in the area. Proceed with yeah. harvest before it's too late. Of 1200. I turned it up though, Bear. I turned up that last one and crank it up some more. I can. That looks weird, but it'll work. All right. How bad was the train crash? Oh, not bad. Okay. Uh, might as well grab some material. Oh, you know what? Fair play, Bear. Fair play. Um, fuck. I have more stuff to build trains with. 
or track i should say i'm okay i'm like at it you got uh pipe and beam anybody i think i do i need to little... put more cars on my uh work train i've got a little pipe and beam on me okay what are we we need to run that other track back i guess all right, Sarge. Yep. Is the foundation done? Yep. Okay. Then it gets other. a little interesting. Up. <laughs> That's okay. It happens. Wow. Infinity. Wow. Wow. No, we're not. Actually, do we need, uh, no, that would be a nightmare, never mind. You didn't hear me say that. I was thinking, like, do we need both, uh, oh, there you go. Do we need both, um, uh, or like another set of platforms to load trains? I don't know. We'll have to, uh, we'll have to, uh, what's it called? There we go. Is that better, John? That actually looks pretty good. Looks pretty good. All right. Oh, you know what? Hang on, John. We can do this too. Color the power poles and everything. Everything. You know what? Though we need to figure out that. Out. Oh. I didn't know you could do the power poles. That's kind of interesting. So I guess if you really wanted to go crazy, you could do like everything on your map. Huh? That's yeah. Kind of. Kind of crazy. We're actually at 6.30 on that pipe, okay? We're over, overcharging it by 30. All right? Comply. So we're good. The other pipe's 600. This one's 6.30, so we're, we're chilling. All right, we're chilling. All right, do you need help on that? You got to have enough material in there to run back, or...? Okay, I will start working on some signals then. Uh, we're gonna need signals, block signals all, that's all of course. Big deal. Learned a lot about signals chat on here. Only had to watch one YouTube video as well. So not bad. Only had to watch one. I don't even want the trains to like potentially stop on the hill to be honest. I know this might be kind of a long block, but that's okay. Trains gonna be down there filling up anyway if there's say there's two here, so not a big deal. Get it up here on the flat before we pop it. Oh. <laughs> I see what you're saying about it being interesting, Sarge. Uh, that's all right. That's funny. Uh, what was wrong with the signal before, Leonard? Was it just that there wasn't one, or? I think it like there was the path signal, and there was no box signals like on, like beside it. Or, you know, further down. 
if that oh. was the last signal on the on the track, I think that would be issue. Okay. Gotcha. Makes sense. Oh wait. 